Oh my hey. gosh. Have y'all met before? Yes. We have. We have. Yes. Okay. We have. Wow. Love you. Okay. Love <laughs> you are amazing. <laughs> too. Oh I my too. goodness. Was your mom a teacher, did I hear? Yes, she yeah. was. She was did a teacher. Did she ever teach you? Yeah, all the time. Yeah, oh, yeah. My dad was a uh, psychologist. My mom a teacher. So that was wow. weird when I got a spanking because I would get a spanking by my mom and then my dad would go, Talk how do you, you about feel it? about that spanking? <laughs> <laughs> how was it? Oh my God. I, was loving, I was loving my parents would be like, um, it'd be like, this hurts me more than it hurts you. I'm like, well, turn around. Let's, let's see. Turn around. Let's just, I mean, might as well try it out. I was like, so wait, your new book, this is called Blessed yes, Mode. Excited. So what made you want to do this? What made me want to do it? Uh, this is really a book to let everyone know that in every emotional wall, there is a divine breakthrough. Right. Oh, and and yeah. uh, a lot of people are going through a lot of things in their lives. Right. That we Boy. don't know about. Especially the last two years. Yeah. And I, I want this book to be a positive way where they can get up in the morning and connect with God and yeah. let them know that they are blessed. They were blessed when they were born, mm -hmm. you know, and that's what it's all about. Blessed yeah. you're still here. Yeah. yeah. Blessed that you're still here. Stay yeah. blessed. You're loved. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. Yeah. Did you ever? Yeah. But it's a 90-day thing, right? So yeah. It's like, that's cool. So it's like every day you kind of have something in well, there? Well, it's, uh, it's a devotional. Oh, yeah, I love that. so uh, in a lot of my ups and downs in my life, God was always there, right? Yeah. For me, and I wanted to show people uh, what I do so that I can get into a positive mindset, mm -hmm. you know? And uh, it works on your mental health, your spiritual health, and your physical health. Yeah. 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 So I start you off with a Bible verse, short story about my life, and then I take you through a prayer. And then my favorite part is called Go Get Them Blessings, right? <laughs> yeah. Where you apply it to your life, right? So I might have you forgive somebody, yeah. or I might have you do a burpee. You know what I mean? Oh, <laughs> do a burpee. I, yeah, I, I, I just want to forgive it's people. Yes, too. Yes, yeah. I'll forgive people. I don't want to do a burpee. That's all. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. So wait, so you talk about your struggle with addiction, right? In yeah. This? Okay, yeah. that's awesome that you're opening up about that because yeah. that's really hard. I have a, um, a few friends, actually. Yeah. Um, do you feel like faith is really what pulled you through? Definitely. Um, it's like, you know, depression is just like frustration that mm. we just keep inside, you know, and we don't, no one can understand. No one can understand what I'm going through and you don't want to talk about it. And I did that a lot, yeah. you know, and then I went to substance abuse and things of that nature to like try to cover it up. But then when I realized like, no, 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 I don't want to cover this up anymore. I want to actually forgive Give myself, shine forgive others, it. and shine a light on it. Yeah, mm -hmm. and actually talk about it. And when I decided to do that and connect more with God, you know what I mean, and connect yeah. on that level, uh, everything started to change around for me. It took a journey, but, uh, you know, in the Bible it says renew your mind daily. And so yeah. that's very important that we renew our mind all the time because this mind is like a disc. It keeps everything, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? And you get reminded of, like, mistakes in the past, things that people all did to you. All the little voices. Yeah, yeah, but, you know, that's why it's so important to, to get up and just know, like, no, no, no. I was made for a purpose. Yeah. I have a purpose today, you know? Yeah. yeah. I unfortunately <laughs> yeah. have had, like, a few people die very young in my life around mm -hmm. me. And it's one of those things where I wake up every day and I'm just, like, thankful to wake up. I'm like, you know, not everybody right. gets that opportunity, like, even if you're having, like, a hard time. Because I've also suffered from depression. Yeah. And I can go zero dark 30. And yeah. so it's, it's one of those things where I think that faith really helped me as well. Are you... Does faith help you at all? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. yeah, I grew up in in the family of faith, and I mean that's my family. That's you know thankful to my mother, and I, I, I'm I'm like you say this career. I came from you know just very very humble, and to have a dream, but to also know there's something greater than you, because you have those yeah. moments and those days and those you know um, things that uh, come against you. And you got to mm. know that you can make it through. You know, it's so, like you say, renew your mind daily. You know, mm -hmm. the word says you're fearfully and wonderfully made. Yes. It also says think on these things. You don't think on what's good, what's positive, this, that's full of joy. Think on those things mm -hmm. because the battlefield is the mind. That's Absolutely. Right. You know? That's right. Yeah. Amen. And it's yeah. making sure you're surrounding yourself with people that have that kind of positive energy as well. And it's exactly. it's so funny. I, I, you know, whatever you believe in, I, there's a lot of beliefs mm -hmm. out there. Mm -hmm. um, but it, it's one of those things where it's, I find it so hard to believe. I'm like, I can't imagine. I think what would, what, what would have killed me would have been like not believing that anything, like any other bigger purpose for us. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing yeah. that I have to feel like we're all a part of something, whatever your spiritual belief is, that we're all, all a part of something that's bigger than us. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I just feel like it, it's a very egocentric thing to not think that, but, mm -hmm. um, so true. but that could be humanity run amok right there with vanity. But <laughs> you yeah. are a blessed man. And this is <laughs> a really, you. really cool Appreciate thing to you. do, not just for you, but for other people. For other people. Right? Yeah, that's what it's, it's about. Really, really cool.